And it's like an ocean And the waves they crash and fall and I feel the motion Cause we're big and then we're small and sometimes we lose it And I'm drowning till I'm out and sometimes you prove it And you bring me back around And you give me that look And you give me those eyes Hey guys! My name is Leanne and I want to share with you my go-to fall look And today I'm trying something a little bit more different um, It's more of a chatty get ready with me And I want to kind of start talking on camera more And share a little bit more about my life and how I do my makeup So if you want to know how I get this look, just keep on watching so I'm going to start priming my face with this. I actually just started using this and I, I like it so far. So I'm just going to do one pump of this. Now I'm going to take a um, Eco Tools uh, version of the beauty blender and honestly this is so much better than the beauty blender this is absolutely my favorite sponge and it blends so well so I already dampened it and now I'm gonna take so this is my everyday go-to it's the um, clean matte BB cream by covergirl so What's going on with my life right now is that I am super excited because next week is actually my boyfriend's birthday and it's our two year anniversary. How that happened is he asked me out on his birthday. <laughs> so now I just really dab. I tell you not, I ain't fine with me Come to everything, it's alright Give me that, give me that, give me that Pretty face, pretty face, pretty baby You're the only one Now I'm gonna use concealer and I use the Maybelline Fit Me in the color light And I'm just gonna put some on my under eyes so if any of you are wondering, I am Taiwanese. I came here when I was nine. I grew up in Texas most of my life and I'm still in Texas and I love it. Now I'm gonna take the um, Tarte Translucent Powder, powder and I'm gonna bake that under my eyes. And I usually do it in between my eyebrows too because this area tends to get oily so I have combination skin. Okay, so I did um, one side of my eyebrows and I'm gonna try to do the other side on the camera. So now I am going to press away the powder that I baked on earlier. So I'm going to use the Too Faced. It's the medium deep matte bronzer. And it smells like chocolate, like everything. I'm also using a um, Equal Tools Define Brush. So my boyfriend and I have been together for two years now. We actually met from a dating app. 
my friend actually made me do a dating app and I was kind of intrigued but I also scared at the same time so I tried it and it was like so much fun because you get to meet all these people that you would never have met otherwise and if you don't like them, you don't have to ever see them again <laughs> Okay, so I'm, now I'm gonna use this Ingold, um, it's actually an eyeshadow butt brush, but I'm gonna use it to contour my nose because that's what I use. I'm gonna take um, the contour kit from Anastasia and I will use um, the contour shade in the middle. So I just dab some here and then move my way up. And then kind of uh, press it downwards so that it's not like a straight, um, stiff line going down the side of my nose. And I also bring in up my eyebrows, up to my eyebrows. And also through the bottom of my nose because I kind of have a long nose. Sometimes I'll do a little bit here, just to give it an illusion of the um, turned up nose, just a bit here. So blush, I'm using um, Tarte's uh, Party Blush, and this actually is the Sephora birthday gift that I got for my birthday, blending in the blush with the bronzer to really the look. So now moving on to highlighter and I use my um, Carly palette for highlighters and this is absolutely my favorite right now. Can you see that? Oh and I'm using this color right here. Then I take some highlighter and not too much. And I just do the tip of my nose and then I don't draw like a straight line because usually that looks really awkward I just do the tip and then I do the center for this fall I look I'm using a combination of my favorite Mono Renaissance by Anastasia and then Too Faced Sweet Peach palette Oh, and the brush I use is actually what it came with in the Model Renaissance palette. I really like this brush. It's super simple and easy to use. Okay, so with the fluffy side, I take the color Georgia here and I apply it on my eye. So I just really apply it from the center to the end of my eye. Now I take Just Peachy, up right here, and then I use Candy Peach. I um, take a combination of both and I apply it to the ends of my eye. Alright, so next I'm going to switch over to the Modern Renaissance palette. I am taking um, a combination of these two colors, the Venetian Red and the Red Ochre, these two colors. <laughs> oh, I need to dab off the excess. And I just use the um, small end of this brush to apply it to the outer corner of my eye. And I just really start working it into out a third of my eye.
Then I use the fluffy side to um, blend everything in. Then I use a little bit more of the red ochre and I apply it to the outer corner of my eye to kind of deepen the color. So with the leftover on the small tip of the brush, I'm going to apply it to the lower thirds of my eye. <laughs> Alright, so now I'm going to uh, do eyeliner off camera. Okay, so I just drew in my eyeliner and I actually just started using the M Cosmetics. Uh, felt tip eyeliner and I love it. It's super comparable to the Stila um, uh, Liquid eyeliner and then I'm going to use Lancome's uh, Eyeliner pencil to draw in um, the The spaces in here I actually wanted to add Bellini to the front of my eyes. I recently found this by Sephora. It's their liquid um, lipstick and it's in color 25. Okay, it's in color 25 and it's th this really pretty um, crimson red. much for making to the end of this video if you want to see more DIY and beauty slash makeup videos just subscribe down below and I'll be posting more videos every month also don't forget to follow me on snapchat and Instagram I'll be posting a lot of cat videos and just bits and pieces about my life so follow me there thank you so much for watching I'll see you next time bye